Inverness were looking to steer clear of an unhappy hat trick at the weekend, having lost their first two home games of the season. Hearts were at the Caledonian Stadium. Here's Paul Mitchell with the story of the match. Cali Thistle have lost both their home matches so far this season. Started well. Duff. Odori Hamill. Well, he's clipped it past the goalkeeper and he finishes. A broad smile on his face. And I think that's because the first touch was unintentional. Appeared to be a miss hit and he did enough to get it home. Lovely pass through from Stuart Duff. And after 37 minutes, Eric Odori Hamill makes it Cali Thistle 1. Hearts nil. Templeton moving down, he's knocks him over, free kick. Templeton himself gets ready to take. Templeton floats it in, it's a goal and it's an own goal. It's been knocked behind his own goalkeeper by Chris Innes. Kevin Kyle was right behind him, but on the stroke of half-time, hearts are level. Well, Chris Innes knew Kevin Kyle was there. And he puts past his own goalkeeper. Duff. It's a good ball on to Adam Rooney. Rooney sees what his options are. Steps inside. Brucey sends it back towards his own goalkeeper. And Marian Kello surprised. He managed to get the ball away. With one on goal on the match. This would have been more spectacular. Get Van Kyle up well. Suzo wants the ball. So with Callum Elliott up against Grant Munro. Back on to Elliott. Kyle wins the header. Breaks through Ryan Stevenson has a chance. Hearts have come from behind to lead at the Cali Stadium. And it's a first hearts goal for Ryan Stevenson. Good play from Kevin Kyle from the header from Callum Elliott. And the shot in off the post to beat Ryan Essen. It's his 15th hearts match. It's his first hearts goal. He's with a corner, headed away, Palazuelo's got the header off the line. May have come off Kevin Kyle, Tokley was in there too. And Palazuelos does his job. On free kick, little flick header on, Callum Elliott goes down, penalty, no, says the referee. Well, Chris Innes took down Callum Elliott, certainly had a hand on him. But the referee says no penalty. And I tell you what, he can't believe it. Good passing play again from Hearts. Unbeaten until the loss against Celtic last week. Here comes Suso. Suso drives it across. That's Callum Elliott. Goal number four of the season for the Hearts striker. And Hearts lead 3 1. Well, he's having a good goal scoring time of it. Callum Elliott. Suso neatly away from his man. Cut inside. Simple, simple finish from Callum Elliott. And Hearts, who are one down, lead 3 1. Long free kick forward. Break back through. Foran got the touch. The flag's up on the far side. Sutherland finishes. But the flag is up and that looked tight. Shane Sutherland denied here. Well, as the ball comes through, well, Boer and Foran almost level. Foran got the touch. That's why the flag went up. Exceptionally close. But it doesn't count. It took a change of ball, apart from anything else, to get Hearts going in this game. Uh, they put a round one on instead of the square one they seemed to be playing with when Eric Odiambo opened the scoring. Yeah, when you look at it again, the ball coming through to him uh, is jumping all over the place here. And Eric's first touch actually knocks it past him and then he bounces it into the ground and goes over the, the de Hearts defender. So you see the big smile on his face and if you look at the ball just now, he's took a bad touch there, he's bounced it into the ground, but the big smile is for the goal. Change of ball, change of personnel as well, because Ian Black went off injured. On came Kevin Kyle, and sometimes it uh, pays to be lucky as a manager, doesn't it? Because he, he played a part in all three Hearts goals. He did play a part. You know, he's, he's a fantastic centre forward in the SPL. He's put in his under pressure. He's put it in. But there's the, the value of him just winning these knockdowns that get midfield players into the box running off him. You get goals from it, and that's a great knockdown. He's not trying to score. You just try to place it down for a, a Hearts midfield player to get on the end of it. And again, there he's playing it wide again to Santana. He's getting himself back in the box. Although it doesn't come to him, 
he attracts Inverness defenders and Callum Elliott is the one who benefits, who gets a tap in. And that's three great goals from Hearts, you know, and Kevin Kyle's played a major part in that.